This video will show you how to install the Absorpol moisture control units in a shipping container. Always inspect the condition of the container before loading. Do not load a container that has cracks in the floor, bed door gaskets, holes in the walls, or roof. Check the condition from the inside with the doors closed. If any light is seeping in, so will humid air. If any of these conditions exist, request a better container before loading. If you ship dry cargo, we also recommend that all ventilation holes be closed with tape. Use plastic electrical tape or duct tape and tape from the inside. You should also tape any small holes or cracks in the wall panels unless you can get the container replaced. If you ship moist cargo, we recommend that the ventilation holes be left open. The Absor pole is designed to hang in the loops located at the top of the container wall panels. Begin by removing the Absor pole unit from its packaging. Only remove an Absor pole unit when you are ready to install it. Begin the installation by twisting off the double pin attached next to the hook. You can now activate the Absor pole by pulling out the inner gray salt container. Until the two holes at the bottom of the grid Match the two holes at the top of the outer blue shell. Next, insert the double pin from the back of the outer blue shell through the two holes in the front and push the double pin in all the way through the two holes until it clicks into place. You are now ready to hang the Absor pole unit in the loops above the corrugation in the wall panel of the container. Pull down on the Absor pole until the hook is all the way at the bottom of the loop. The number of Absorpol units needed for a container shipment depends on the type of cargo and size of container. For dry cargo, like steel, aluminum, and copper products, loaded into a 20-foot container, use 4 to 8 Absorpol units. For moist cargo, such as agricultural products, loaded into a 20-foot container, 8 to 12 Absorpol units are recommended. For dry products, loaded into a 40-foot container, Use 8 to 12 Absor pole units. For moist cargo loaded into a 40 foot container, 12 to 20 Absor pole units are recommended. Install the recommended number of Absor pole units evenly along both sides of the container. However, if you are loading cargo very close to the side walls of the container, we do not recommend that you install all the Absor poles before loading. Instead, we recommend that you install only the first two Absor poles. Then load some cargo next to them. Then hang another two units and load more cargo. And so on until fully loaded. This will prevent damage to the Absor pole units from cargo crates as they are moved into the container. When loading cargo, make sure to leave 15 inches to 20 inches 400 to 500 millimeters of free space between the ceiling of the container and the cargo. This will allow the salt in the upper part of the Absor pole units to effectively absorb any moisture in the container during its voyage. To reduce the cost of an Absor pole installation, which is required for a tight cargo load, you can use two Absor bag units in the front corners of the container to replace two Absor poles since they will be protected from damage in this recessed corner space. These installation instructions are also shown on the back of the Absor pole technical data sheet. To remove the Absor pole units after you have unloaded the cargo, simply unhook each unit from the loop at the top of the sidewall panels. Keep each unit upright. Dispose of the unit according to your company's waste disposal procedures. The Absor pole is made from recyclable PVC plastics. Thank you for following the proper Absor pole installation procedures.